Good morning. Welcome to the forecast discussion for Monday, December 4th, 2023. Of course, I'm your meteorologist, Stephen DiMartino. Well, we have a cold front that has gone through the region, and we have a couple more that's on the way that's going to keep us a bit unsettled. We have winds this morning from the U.S. southwest around 5 to 10 miles per hour. It's along the coast, is more from the southwest around 5 miles per hour. We did have some locally dense fog early this morning but that has now broken away and temperatures range from the mid to upper 30s in your higher elevations upper 30s to lower 40s in the northern interior and lower to mid 40s in your urban areas it's warming up pretty nicely down southern new jersey and along the immediate coast where we have temperatures in the mid to upper 40s so a wide range of temperatures depending on the amount of cloud cover and your wind direction but generally 30s and 40s as we look at our surface map and radar from weather tap you can see a series of cold fronts and little troughs and low pressure systems are all rotating around the region this is all going to be rotating through over the next couple of days leading to scattered cloud cover and isolated rain and snow shower here nothing significant in terms of any storms this looks pretty robust but this is going to get suppressed to our south due to this low pressure system here. And you can see on the infrared satellite picture, plenty of little short waves rotating through, getting ready to drop through. We got one here in central Canada, just off the map, another one in Northern Plains, another one in the Ohio River Valley, and then this one here in the Great Lakes and the um, St. Lawrence River Valley. So this is all going to be rotating through. And as they're rotating through, they'll be weakening. So as a result, as they approach you again up with sky cloud cover light precipitation if you have any uh, and no major storms at least not until we get to the end of next weekend let's dive into the forecast and get to that point so for today sky cloud cover watch out for an isolated rain and snow shower but for the most part tranquil with temperatures ranging from the lower to mid 40s over the northern interior upper 40s to lower 50s along the coast for tonight into tomorrow again a series of troughs move through sky cloud cover isolated rain and snow shower low temperatures range from the upper 20s to lower 30s over the northern interior lower to mid 30s along the coast tomorrow afternoon rinse and repeat sky cloud cover isolated rain and snow shower Temperatures a bit chillier with high temperatures in the mid to upper 30s over the northern interior, lower to mid 40s along the coast. For Wednesday, another area low pressure drops through, intensifies more over the coastal waters, but far enough away to only produce a passing isolated rain and snow shower. Other than that, sky cloud cover is expected with low temperatures in the upper 20s to lower 30s and high temperatures ranging from the lower to mid 30s over the northern interior and upper 30s to mid 40s along the coast on thursday another little weak low pressure system will drop on through again an isolated rain or snow shower is possible but for the most part we're looking at sky cloud cover look at low temperatures ranging from the lower to mid 20s over the northern interior mid to upper 20s along the coast and high temperatures in the lower to mid 30s over the northern interior upper 30s to lower 40s along the coast on friday high pressure will pass through with sky cloud cover and a shift to the winds more from the southwest look for low temperatures in the lower to mid 30s high temperatures will range from the mid to upper 40s over the northern interior, upper 40s to lower 50s along the coast. On Saturday, that high pressure system shifts further out in the Atlantic, certainly a stronger southwesterly wind as a result. Look for low temperatures ranging from the lower to mid 40s. High temperatures will be rather mild for this time of year, ranging from the lower to mid 50s over the northern interior, mid to upper 50s on the coast, and upper 50s to lower 60s in the Delaware River Valley. But on Sunday, we pay for that. With an area low pressure and strong cold front approaching, look for increasing clouds through the day with rain developing towards the evening and then some very heavy rain and possibly some embedded thunderstorms on Sunday evening into early Monday morning. Low temperatures on Sunday will range from the upper 30s to lower 40s. High temperatures will range from the upper 50s over the northern interior, lower to mid 60s along the coast, and there is a concern here on Sunday evening into Monday morning for a line of some strong thunderstorms here. So we have to keep an eye on that. Certainly if any outdoor decorations, you might want to make sure they're secured by Sunday. 
so that way nothing goes flying off into your neighbor's yard by Monday morning. So a very impressive cold front on the move with that cold front clearing the region on Monday morning with periods of rain, lows in the Monday morning ranging from the lower to mid 40s over the northern interior, upper 40s to lower 50s along the coast. Those are the morning lows. Note I said morning lows because in the afternoon that cold front clears out, skies clear out, temperatures rapidly jump into the upper 40s to lower 50s over the northern interior mid 50s to lower 60s along the coast but that's going to be in the late morning hours and then in the afternoon and evening behind this cold front and with strong cold air transport on the way look for windy conditions with temperatures falling through the 50s 40s 30s and eventually into the 20s so certainly be prepared for that by next monday that's your forecast discussion for today have a wonderful day and as always Stay safe out there.